everyone. I have a spring double layout here that I'm going to show how to make this really fun 3D flower out of basil cardstock. I used um, pink, uh, the piglet for pink, and there's a, this is actually yellow in the center of the circle, and it's called lemon drop. So I'll show you again kind of a better idea of what there we go, the two pages look like together. And I will be making this bigger half daisy and I'll show you how right now. I've set out all the pieces I need from to make my 3D flower. Like I said, I cut this from the Basil Piglet pink cardstock. So I have three sizes of petals, about 10 of each. The small one is two inches high and half an inch wide. Then the medium size is um, two and a half inches high. And the large size is three inches um, high or long. Then my center circle is cut out of lemon drop and it is two inches wide. So on top of this, I have placed, like I said, the um, Scrapbook Adhesives by L three um, adhesive sheet and cut it out. Now I cut out all, all the petals with my scan and cut machine, but you know, you can cut them out with whatever you like. Um, so I will start by cutting my um, centerpiece in half. All right. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to use both halves. The first half I will turn over and I have this yellow showing. This has no adhesive on it. And basically, I am going to apply adhesive using my uh, Easy Runner to the back of this yellow piece. And then using my small and medium, I'm going to alternate placing them around my flower. And basically, I just go all the way around. I do small, medium, small, medium, and so on. All right. Now you can see this is going to be lined up flush, like so. So straight across because it's going to meet the edge of my layout. If you look here, you can see how it's flush. So this is what I'm basically making. I'm making it like this. So I'm making this top layer of small and medium petals. So I'll just fast forward this so you don't have to watch this process of me sticking down these petals. Okay. Now we're going to do the other side using the large petals only. Again, I'm putting adhesive on the other side and I'll fast forward this. Okay, here I have my two layers, one with the large petals that are three inches high and one with my small and medium petals. And what I'm going to do now is make a sandwich with these petals. So I'm going to take my crafty foam tape. It's a 3D foam tape by Scrapbook Adhesives by 3L. And I will stick these two petal sandwiches together. So I'll just snip little pieces of it and make it fit onto the back of this. And again, you can adjust the size of your flowers. They don't have to be this size. You can make them bigger or smaller. I remove the backing. Then I'm going to flip this over carefully, like so, 
and make my sandwich. There. So there I have my daisy sandwich together with all of the different petals. All right, now I'm gonna show you how to make this really fun textured centerpiece. And I'm going to use um, microbeads. So I have some Martha Stewart microbeads in orange and gold. And again, you can adjust this for any kind of a flower center. Now remember, I have an adhesive backing on this. If you didn't put an adhesive backing, you can just add uh, like a clear liquid adhesive. So you wanna take off the backing. to expose the adhesive. And then I'm going to put my microbeads here in my little dish, the gold and the orange mixed. Again, you can put any color of microbeads you want. Just fair warning, microbeads get everywhere if you don't have a tray of some sort. Okay, so I'm kind of mixing them up. And then what I'm going to do is I'm gonna push my flower, that's adhesive is exposed, right into those microbeads and push down hard. And so my adhesive should grab up a lot of them. There you go. And I'll go again and just push down. And I see a little bit of a spot here. So I want to get that there. And there you have this really cool textured flower center. I know, can you see it? And it's very glittery. And you have a pretty 3D flower daisy. So I hope you can make some spring projects for yourself and say goodbye to winter. Thanks for watching. Mm -hmm.